Hello, hello everybody and welcome to Gazi's Extra. As you can tell from my voice, I'm very excited about this one. First, we need to go to system and then look for developer options. Press on on ADB debugging and app for unknown sources. Press on OK. OK, let's go and look for our IP address in system and then click on about network and remember the IP address will be used in a bit. OK, on your phone, download the link from the description and install it. Next, install. AGK Fire is more than amazing. The developer have done something that was requested for a long time. Thank you a lot. OK, first we'll need to enter our Fire TV IP address or Fire TV stick IP address. All right, so let's press on done. OK. I think I will start with a paid app, which is really shocking. You can now install paid app on your Fire TV without roots. Some of them will work and some of them will not work, as you can see. It will take a little bit and it will be installed for sure. OK, let's uh, install Geekbench 3. Geekbench 3 is really good because it tells you how fast your Fire TV or Fire TV stick. Alright, so let's download Kodi or XBMC. With uh, APKs, you can click on the menu and select an APK file. Let's look for our downloaded APK. You can use any APK you want, but I'm going to use XBMC. This process, because it's a big file, might take longer than usual. OK, it's done. Let's go back to our Fire TV or Fire TV stick. And let's look for our XBMC. So far, this is the best uh, way to sideload or install any application from the Play Store or anywhere. Just right from your tablet or your phone. Amazing. OK, as well, I recommend highly to watch the other video to make your Fire TV awesome so you can get this great view. Let's try Geekbench. It's a free app. Should work just fine. <clears throat> and let's try again XBMC from this menu because it's much easier than going all the way to menu, manage and launch the application. Let's try a paid app now. This one is called Reflector. And it's allowed to stream your iPad and iOS device, even your Mac, to your Fire TV or your Fire TV stick. Let's give it a try. I'll try it with uh, my iPad mini. Let's click on Enable Mini Ring. And it should work in a minute. Here we go. Anyway, if you like this video and you want to see more, please subscribe and take care.